DTE Energy is launching a new program to help cut down on power outages in Metro Detroit by burying some power lines underground. Yeah, the pilot program's launching in two neighborhoods. 7 Action News reporter Darren Cunningham is in Hamtramck, where he spoke with residents who say this is much needed and they hope that work starts sooner rather than later. DTE says more than 400 customers stand to benefit from a pilot program bearing electrical lines here in the Buffalo Charles neighborhood. I think it would be a good idea. Jamal Alnamir lives on Sparling Street in Hamtramck in an area he says is prone to power outages, especially during a storm. Maybe like a month ago, there was like a big rain yeah. and the power went out. Okay. Yeah. And it takes like one 24 hours and then it went back again. An inconvenience for residents of the Davison and Buffalo Charles neighborhoods. But Alnamir says DTE recently came to his door delivering some good news, letting him know crews will be burying the power lines as part of a pilot program. DTE says putting the lines underground and away from the detriment of heavy winds and damaged trees is just one way it's working to reduce the frequency of outages. I hope it's going to be soon. It's not going to take a year to fix it. Morgan Elliott and Hazy, a director with DTE who oversees the project, says the work is projected to be complete in the first quarter of 2025. Why this area? Great question. So this area in particular was chosen for two reasons. One, it is an area that unfortunately has experienced poor reliability in the recent past. And so we know that we have to make some sort of investment in this neighborhood to improve the reliability for our customers. The second reason? She says investments on the gas lines were already scheduled to take place, as you see here. So to save money, DTE figured it makes sense to bury the power lines while working on the gas lines. As we speak, we're actually investigating what areas we're going to go to next year. Uh, we do have a plan in the next five years to spend about $9 billion as we rebuild our infrastructure to help improve the reliability for our customers. And a big portion of that strategy that we're working through right now is going to be undergrounding our lines. Elliot Andehazy says the cost of the pilot program is still being figured out, but crews will start burying the power lines in October in Hamtramck. Darren Cunningham, 7 Action News. Thank you, Darren.